Sagittarius. Because there's a lot of messages coming in. And I don't want, if they're, if they're scattered messages, like I'm trying to figure out what this all means. Okay, well, I do get that balance is going to be very important. The sign of Libra, I'm getting Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. I'm getting the air signs. So I feel like some of you are doing a lot of thinking in May, and you have a decision to make. I think, you know, what goes around comes around, and I think that justice will be served regarding the situation. Maybe that's why it's picking up on children. There may be some legalities for some of you regarding children. This could be child custody, child support, spousal support. There's issues around that. I think there's even a question of whether or not you want to stay or, or go in terms of a situation. Now, I'm also getting, I feel like somebody's having children because so, I'm seeing, um, okay, I'm seeing uh, a birth certificate. So congratulations, because I feel like a child is being delivered, but I'm also getting something about legalities regarding visas or travel visas. I feel like some of you are, wanting to travel you may be getting your passport together or visa together that's coming through but balance is going to be very much key so those are some messages that are coming in with this card now i'm also getting something about um, uh, back to let me move this forward a little bit there's something, I think, uh, about horses, and I wonder if somebody is trying to do something for children or for even uh, adults or something with disability and horses, and there may be some legalities or paperwork that is needed in order to get this kind of off the ground. I'm also getting, like, someone's horsing around. There's a play on that word. I'm getting also... The truth, I'm hearing the truth will set you free. There's something that is possibly being hidden, I feel, that will be revealed. Let's pull another card. Yeah. The five of cups. What I'm getting, I do like the fives myself better in reverse. This can represent Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But, <clears throat> excuse me. Okay, so... Usually when that happens, it's like somebody doesn't have a voice or they feel like they're not being heard. Um, somebody, I'm getting repressed emotions. You may have to go back to your past in order to be able to move forward. Or there's possibly somebody, I'm getting like forgiveness. This may not be you. You may be asking for forgiveness and somebody isn't having it or somebody is asking for forgiveness and you're not having it. Or it goes back and forth, back and forth, like there's something that's being stuck. But I'm getting also something with the lower back or difficulty in moving. So it could be that, you know, difficulty in moving forward from something from the past. It could be also physically difficulty in moving. This may be surgery. This someone's having surgery on their lower back. But you know what? I just heard that. What is that? Oh, God. Okay. I heard something about like with horses or something like somebody uses a phrase like I don't know if they're a pain in the arse. I don't know. I don't use that. So that's coming for somebody. Someone's a, a a horse's pain, or I forgot, what's that saying? Pain in the neck? Okay. Somebody may be having neck pain, considering neck surgery. But what I'm getting is that there is possibly a lack of support, a lack of emotional support. And this could be from a marriage, from a partnership, 
Uh, could also be, I'm picking up something about drinking. So I don't think this is you. I think this could be somebody around you where maybe they're hiding something about drinking. Like they're having difficult times, a difficult time dealing with their emotions. And uh, so they drink instead. But I feel like this is being hidden. Something is being hidden or sh I'm getting the word shelter. So someone sheltering something um, or someone from pain. So I feel like maybe you're taking a big burden on so that you don't have to expose somebody else to this burden. Now, it could also be that somebody's just footloose and fancy free and they're not really being respectful or mindful of your emotions and your feelings. Um, wow. There's definitely a legal situation going on here for somebody. I feel like there's, there's resolution though. Something gets resolved by the end of May. I do also, this is Archangel Gabriel. That may have a very strong meaning for somebody. There, okay, hold on one second here. Archangel Gabriel. I feel like maybe somebody's writing. Writing a book. It might be automatic writing. Might be journaling. Someone's taking notes. May also be that somebody has like been rejected from a book or publishing or trademarking, copywriting. There could be um, an argument for copyright, uh, intellectual property, uh, something like that is uh, going on. But there's also news that comes in out of the blue. And it could also be return of somebody in terms of love out of the blue. And there's a decision that you have to make. That's what I'm getting. And you may be torn. I just heard torn between two lovers, feeling like a fool. Something is breaking all the rules. This song has been coming up for quite a few of my past readings. All right, let me pull another. Yeah, the Seven of Swords. Um, I feel like I like the Sevens in reverse for me in my readings. I feel like somebody was probably trying to get away from something or away from someone or trying to get away with something. And I think that legally, uh, something's going to get revealed. You're going to see this. I just am curious to see what's underneath. If I can get it. I think that this is going to definitely get resolved. Oh my gosh. Well, what have I been talking about children? I feel like, Something about your childhood, about your past, healing from that is going to be helpful. Again, this might be a play on children, child support, child custody. I'll, I'm all still getting the horse. Oh, there's the horse. Wow. Let me adjust the light a little bit. So... Some of you, I think, uh, are making a decision with a heavy heart. And I think it's regarding... This may even be, um, yeah, there's a decision about love, about marriage for some of you, not all of you. Um, some of you, I feel like it's somebody from the past that comes back. And for some of you, I think that this could be somebody from childhood, from um, like you might meet, all of a sudden get a message or a phone call or from someone on Facebook. That's how it's coming across for me. Are they some kind of like a social media? But I was going to say something else. Um, and now it slipped my mind. Oh, I hate when that happens. Sometimes the messages come in so quickly that I miss one. I'm also getting something. I feel like somebody may be considering filing Chapter 7 is what I'm uh, picking up. But I feel like someone has also been um, 
Yeah, this is also going back to, I think that somebody's considering some kind of surgery, back or neck or foot surgery. There's something about someone's foot or a foot, like A-F-O-O-T. But uh, there's definitely sacrifices that I feel that someone's being, that someone is making big sacrifices and, um, but there's, there's a need for more support around you. I love that the sun card is here. And, uh, so something positive is going to emerge, I feel, in May out of some, you know, possibly letting go of things. Now, what I was saying about the seven of, of in reverse, to me, it's time to move on. It's time to move on from a situation or, uh, and I think you will be in a positive way, especially with the beautiful sun. So, okay, these are the messages I'm getting, Sagittarius, for you. Thank you so much for watching. All right, take care. Bye.